Welcome back to Fast Gadgets. So I'm here with my Lenovo Yoga 910 and I thought we might have a little bit of fun with it. There are three possible bio settings for the Lenovo Yoga 910 and I'd like to do some testing to see if the bio settings actually really make any difference as far as performance goes. So here's what I'm thinking of doing. Now the three bio settings that are available are, and I'm going to shut down this light real quick. The three bio settings that are available are um, quiet mode. I think there's one called balanced and one called performance. And right now it's on quiet mode. So what I'd like to do is run Geekbench 3 and our overall goal is to find out if those settings make any differences as far as performance. So, you know, I I can tell that there is a difference with the fan noise and that's one of the downsides to the Yoga 910 is it, it does have quite a bit of fan noise. Uh, but with quiet mode running, it's perfectly fine. Now I would like to point out in the operating system itself, um, the setting is for balanced, okay? So I'm gonna leave the setting in the operating system for balance because I wanna change only one environment variable. And in this case, the one that I'm going to change is the settings in the BIOS. So what we have right now is the balanced setting in the operating system and the quiet mode setting in the BIOS. And we're going to see what kind of score we can get here. And I'm probably going to run a couple of benchmarks. I've got another one I'd like to run, Nova Bench. And just see if either one of those actually records a change with these bio settings. All right, Internet Destroyer came up. So we've got a respectable score here. 30, 36, and 54, 28 multi-core. And this is certainly a much more spunky machine than... Um, my previous Yoga 2 Pro. So, we are going to power off, do a shutdown. I'm going to say shutdown anyway. I really don't think I have anything important there. We're going to cruise into the bio setup and I'm going to show you that actual setting change. System performance mode. So we have quiet mode, which is the newest one. We have high performance mode and we have balanced. I'm thinking I'm going to do every one of them. So let's do balanced mode. We'll exit and save changes and we'll boot back into Windows. Mm -hmm. All right. And we'll go right back to it with Geekbench. You know, I did say I was going to run Nova, didn't I? And I didn't. Well, we're going to try Geek, Geekbench then and see how it does. And I'll say later and run benchmarks. So theoretically, the fan could get much louder now. Yeah, that's louder. That's definitely louder. And our score for the quiet mode in the BIOS was 3036 for single core and 5428 for multi-core. Uh, yeah, that is a significant change actually. We had 3502 for single core and 7124 for multi-core. That's pretty good. That's that's a significant difference. I really didn't expect that much for multi-core. And for my video rendering, it definitely would make a difference. So I may just use that setting from now on, even though the fan is a little bit louder, unfortunately. But um, the fan quality just isn't as good as the Lenovo Yoga 2 Pro was. They could ramp up and go really fast, and you couldn't even tell. So I'm going to hold down the Shift key and do a restart. And we're going to see if we can get this to boot back up into BIOS settings and we're going to change it to high performance and see what kind of changes we get. We're going to go back to system performance mode. We're going to put that sucker on high performance. If 
find out what kind of benchmarking we get with high performance. I have a suspicion it really won't be much better than balance, but we'll see. Well, as luck would have it, my camera ran out of storage space, but I've quickly remedied that, and I have the final scores for the balanced and high performance mode in the BIOS. So it was balanced mode for the operating system, high performance for the BIOS, and there was a small change, not significant. Well, I shouldn't say that. The multi-core improved to 7620 over 7124 in balanced mode and 5428 in quiet mode. So there is quite a penalty for using the uh, quiet mode. And I think what I'm going to do now, I just noticed that all the tests I performed, the battery, we were running off of battery. So I'm just going to plug in the charger. I'm going to close the browser. I'm going to run the benchmarks over and make sure that the battery being unplugged wasn't a mitigating factor. Okay, there wasn't really any improvement running on the charger as opposed to the battery. There was a tiny spike for single core from 3541 to 3575 and an actual reduction in multi-core from the previous score of 7620 to 7608 so I think it's really minimal. Now the next thing I'm going to do and I'm only going to do it for uh, the setting with the BIOS in uh, high performance mode. I'm going to go into power options and right now I'm on balance I'm gonna switch to high performance and let's see if high performance in the operating system and high performance in the BIOS have any any changes in the score alright so running in high performance mode um, there is absolutely no benefit whatsoever to running the operating system in high performance mode We've got 3548 for single core. We had 3541 for single core when in balanced mode. And 7605, we actually got 7620 when we were in balanced mode in the, the operating system. So my thinking is I'm just going to leave the setting to balanced here. And I do think what I'm going to do with the BIOS is run it in balanced from now on, even though it is definitely louder, uh, which is unfortunate for me. But it's really funny. Um, it just goes to show with hardware manufacturers how they are prone to fix things. Um, there's really nothing they can do with the poor quality fans that they put into these units. So what they've opted for instead of really fixing the problem, which they, they can't do without a recall of some sort or an offer to switch the fans, is actually make the system perform more poorly. So, And it was a significant chunk. And that's really disappointing, but uh, not a lot that can be done about it. And I think I'm going to stick with balance from now on because I will get a greater... Uh, performance level when I am rendering video and playing games so it makes sense for me as always thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed the video uh, like and subscribe if you did if you really like it drop me a comment whether good or bad and um, also share it I would really appreciate it thank you very much see you next time